Hi folks, I'm Colby Grant, the Northwestern Regional Specialist with the Nutrient and Pest Management Program. And I'm Dan Marzu, I'm the North Central Region Nutrient and Pest Management Program. So Dan, I've been hearing a lot of talk lately about high fertilizer prices this next year and I was wondering, can a nutrient management plan help us get uh, the most value for the dollars we're spending on fertility? Oh, definitely. So uh, what a nutrient management plan does is actually allow a farmer to take a look at their crop rotation and then take a look at their soil tests and then find that optimum soil uh, fertilizer rate um, to put out there on their crop. So uh, they might find out that they're putting way too much uh, phosphorus out in one field and not enough potash on another field. So it'll be allow, allow them to actually take, take a look at those and find that right rate out there to put for those commercial fertilizers. That sounds great. What about uh, crediting nutrient sources? I've been hearing some talk about that. Right, uh, with a nutrient management plan, it is very important to take credits for those types of nutrients. So we're talking about the manure uh, applications and any type of legume credits, so such as alfalfa, you know, some folks might have some clover out there. There's actually uh, uh, nutrient credits that you could put out there, uh, cr use for, to grow your crops the following year. So if I'm looking for assistance for nutrient management planning, uh, who could I talk to to start a plan? Sure, uh, a lot of county extension educators actually help uh, develop a plan. Also your uh, county land and water conservation departments help. Uh, folks from the Department of Ag, Trade and Consumer Protection are also there for assistance. And then also uh, folks like uh, Colby and I at the Nutrient and Pest Management Program also help develop these plans.